back with another banger for you guys today. And as you can see by the title, we have another SML movie. I was asked in the comments of yesterday's video for you guys uh, wanting me to react to the other SML videos that came out this week that I missed. You guys said they were absolute bangers, which normally all SML videos are. And this one is called Jeffy's Lie Detector. So we finna dive right into this. Before we do so, you guys can follow me on my gaming channel. The link for that will be in the description down below. And make sure you guys are subscribed to this channel with notifications turned on so you don't miss any of the uploads. And let's dive right into this lie detector test. Oh, I'm high as hell doing this video. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. <laughs> I have not seen those kind of raisins since I was a kid, literally. My grandma used to have those kinds of raisins. dinner's ready. Father? What the heck? You know I don't like green beans. Jeffy, I made them different. I put something special in them. What did you do? Get a hamster and take a poop in No, Jeffy, those are raisins. You're eating green beans and raisins, and me and Rose are eating macaroni and cheese and raisins. What is a, what is a sweet combination that raisins be inside of that I actually think is good? Like, uh, I think it's like chicken salad or something it has raisins in it and it's kind of like the same color as green beans that's the only thing i think i like with raisins in it to be honest and, and our oatmeal raisin cookies i just got one question for you who's your dealer what do you mean who's my dealer whoever you buy your drugs from because you're so high i want to puff whatever you're puffing oh jeffy's standing on me can you eat a mighty toilet no because you're gonna flush another toilet can i eat a mighty trash can no because you're gonna throw away the trash can well can i eat him in my room no this room where's he gonna put it anyway in his uh, you know in his pillowcase or under his mattress <laughs> no, <that's> <laughs> you know what marvin really wanted to, to say he didn't say his intrusive oh, thoughts out loud right, Jeffy, you can eat your room but i'm gonna come check on you in five minutes and you better eat this you that's a big ass room. plate of green beans too bro they're trying to turn jeffy into popeye in the motherfucker yeah, you eat every single one of them better not find one on the ground <laughs> i remember they broke that door bro that shit was crazy <laughs> Jeffy a real nigga if he do this. Real nigga. Okay, Jeffy. Okay. He said, fuck what Marvin talking about. But leaving the front door open is crazy. Guys, this is literally what happens when you leave the front door open. Oh, the pets get out. So that's how they get hit by too, vehicles Marvin. or just that's how they that's how anything can happen. They run away. I've Marvin. experienced those oh, things. Seen that happen. And you know it. I'm gonna go check on Jeffy. Jeffy sure tripping. Green beans. All right, Jeffy, I'm coming to check to make sure you ate your green beans. Wait, wait a minute. What? The front door's open. Whoa. <laughs> uh, Rose, the front door's <coughs> wide open. Um, your cat might have escaped. What? Uh, the front door's wide open. I don't know if your cat got out. Oh, she carrying out. Okay, did you see him anywhere? I haven't seen him. Well, we gotta go look for him. Kitty, kitty, kitty. Kitty, kitty, kitty. Kitty, kitty. <laughs> Y'all gotta be living in Arizona or some shit to be worried about coyotes, the fuck? In the neighborhood like this. Jeffy? Yeah, daddy? Have you seen pumpkin anywhere? It's not Halloween yet, daddy. I'm not talking about an actual pumpkin. I'm talking about that orange cat. Nope. Because the front door was left wide open. Did you leave the front door open? Nope. Because if Rose's cat got out, she's going to be upset. Nope. <laughs> Jeffy, did you eat your green beans? Yep. Then where's the fork? Daddy, it was so good. I swallowed the fork too, but I choked on it like Squidward. Like, <laughs> But you wouldn't get it. Jeffy a little too good at that. And on top of that, he just ruined his story automatically, okay? With saying problems. that you swallowed Jeffy, the fork. Be honest with me. The front door is left wide open. If you tell me right now, I won't be mad. Oh, fork dick has four tips. Pees out of all of them. Jeffy, I'm being serious. Me too. If you had a fork dick, that's what it would do. All right, listen. If you've seen pumpkin anywhere, you let us know because the front door is left wide open. Oh, butter knife dick cuts butter and shit. <laughs> all right, Jeffy, you're not taking this seriously. If you see <laughs> Jeffy that, OD. Jeffy, you let me know. Got it, got it. His sense of humor is, okay, is trying. <laughs> missing pumpkin flyers for us to put around the neighborhood. Uh, baby, you didn't put a picture of the cat. Right. I know, but I put his name, Pumpkin. <laughs> yeah, but we know his name's Pumpkin, but other people don't know his name, so they're going to think you're talking about a missing pumpkin. I am right. talking about a missing pumpkin. Oh, no, my God. Rose, dumb, who's dumber, Rose or Jeffy? Uh, <laughs> yeah, so go add a picture of Pumpkin. <laughs> but Marvin, I already printed out so many. It's okay. You can print more. Go. Okay. All right, Marvin, I fixed the flyers. <laughs> Pumpkin Maybe looks so innocent. Ink. All I see is the SPCA commercial right now in my head. <laughs> okay, I guess these will work. Let's go put them around the neighborhood. Marvin, we should put them on stop signs. Baby, that's dangerous. People are not going to see the stop sign. They're going to get in a wreck. Yeah, right, that's see selfish. The of our missing cat. <sighs> okay, we'll do a few stop signs. Come on. Okay. <laughs> right. Marvin's just doing any. <laughs> that's what niggas do, bro. Niggas, we would. <laughs> 
<laughs> niggas will tell a woman anything to get them to, to stop talking. Literally, bro. I promise you. There's like, <laughs> Let's just hope someone calls. Hey there. What the cops? What are you doing here? Did you find our missing cat? No, but now I know you guys are the ones who've been putting these posters up on stop signs. We thought that was the best place for people to see them. Oh, I saw the poster. Don't worry about that. <laughs> and of course he ran the stop sign and hit the cat. I a family of six in a minivan. Yeah, the van rolled like 15 <laughs> times because I was going pretty fast, and two of them have been declared dead on the scene. The rest of them had to get life lighted to the hospital. Oh, except for the one who's still trapped under the car. They got to use the jaws of life to get him out, but still, he's going to be pretty mangled. I didn't didn't get hurt because I'm drunk, but I mean, hey, I'm sure that's woke me. This is the worst cop self-incriminating story I've ever heard in my entire life, bro. Like, what? So you didn't find our missing cat? You faced no, like three murder sure. charges. Pumpkin's not gray. <laughs> I know pumpkin's not gray. What the fuck are you talking about? I'm not stupid. No, the cat pumpkin isn't gray. He's orange. That cat is gray. I'm looking right at him. No, the printer ran out of ink. My God. He's orange. I cannot imagine that cat being orange. He is gray in my mind. But why would we name a gray cat pumpkin? That's exactly what I was wondering. Listen, he's orange. Just, just imagine him orange. Okay, well, you should really put his name on the poster. Well, see, that's what I thought. <laughs> I didn't even think about, think about that. Brooklyn guy, even though he's being annoying about this situation, y'all. Picture of the cat on here. I, he has a point, though. How are you going to know if the cat is orange without the picture being colored? You should really put these two posters together. Hey, that's a good idea. Yeah, just don't put them on stop signs. Put them on yield signs. Yeah, fuck yielding. I never yield. Anyway, how did your cat get loose anyway? <laughs> I don't know. I was walking by the front door and it was wide open. And then I think he ran out when the door was open. And I asked my son if he left the door open and he told me no. Is he a liar? What? Is your son a liar? Is he prone to fabrication? Or liar, liar, liar pants, pants for hire. Lie sometimes. <laughs> That's what Patrick used to say on Spongebob. In your car, you have a lie detector? Yeah, I mean, I made it. I was on my way to the police station to interrogate someone with it, but I could use it on your son to see if he opened the door. Yeah, yeah, go <laughs> grab it. I want to see if Jeffy's lying about leaving the door open, if it was him or not. Okay. Use it on right, Rose, Marvin. <laughs> This is really a time machine? They no, really put this shit together. I'm weak like, as hell. Oh, yeah, a time machine. Does it work? <laughs> it's not a time machine, Marvin. It's a fucking lie detector. Oh. <laughs> that just broke character. It's a fucking lie detector. <laughs> Does it work? Yeah, it works really well. See, whenever you tell a lie, it lights up red. And when you, whenever you tell the truth, it lights up green. And if you tell a super lie, a horn goes off that says, liar, in my voice. Here, try it out. Put it on your head. There you go, Marvin. Are you bald? No. <laughs> See? Oh, no, I have hair on the sides of my head. <laughs> See, Marvin, it works. Okay, well, Rose, can you put it on? I have some questions for you. Uh, no, I gotta go to the bathroom. Well, I have questions. <laughs> no, believe me, buddy, sometimes it's better to not know. <laughs> that part. <laughs> okay, Marvin, ask me if I have a big wiener. Do you have a big wiener? <laughs> no. Oh, oh shit! Oh shit! <laughs> that was the unexpected. Holy, holy dick! Curls up in a ball when he gets scared and shit. Yeah. My <laughs> Listen, Jeffy, this is a time machine. Marvin, I swear to God, let me do the talking. This is not a time machine. Oh, time machine, dick, goes back in time and shit. No, it's not a time machine. It's a lie detector. Oh, lie detector, dick. It oh my lie. God, Jeffy, oh bro, if you don't shut your ass up, let me tell you. Yes, Jeffy, it's lies. And did you leave that front door open? No. Well, we're going to ask you with the time machine. <laughs> it's not a time machine, Marvin. God damn it. Oh, we're going to ask the light okay, Logan really laughed in this motherfucker. Like... All right, Jeffy, it's all set up. So if you're lying, the red light will light up. And if you're telling the truth, the green light will light up. Oh, red light, green light, dick. Stops and goes and shit. Jeffy, if you do one more shit dick thing, you're grounded. I swear. I... Shit dick. Covered in shit and smells like shit and shit. You're grounded, Jeffy. Marvin, just ask you questions. Questions. All right, Jeffy, did you leave the front door open? Yes. You said earlier you didn't. I know I lied. Oh, okay, so now you're going to you're going to tell the truth? Yeah, because you're going to find out the truth anyway. Oh, oh. He caught it in a time machine again. I just peeped that. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, oh, wow, there's no point having the time machine then. Marvin, it's not a time machine. No, there's no point having a lie detector then if you're going to start telling the truth now. Well, just ask more questions. All right, Jeffy, do you know where Pumpkin is? No, I do not know where he is. Okay, you're telling the truth with that. Did you leave the front door open on purpose? Yes. Well, why would you do that? Because I'm a fuck. Oh, <laughs> Jeffy irritating as fuck. Yes. <laughs> what is that? Wait, mean? wait, I whoa! Know. I've never seen that. If you if your brain can do both at the same time, you must be a very, very good liar deep down, bro. Jesus. <laughs> All right, Jeffy. Is there anything else you want to admit to? Oh, Pinocchio dick gets longer as I lie and shit. 
No, Jeffy, there was this one time that pumpkin was covered in poop. Why was he covered in poop? Well, because I wiped my ass with him after I took a shit. <laughs> you said he rolled around the litter box. <laughs> well, he did that too. Fuck. What? Jeffy, that is it. You're going to go to your room and you're grounded. You're not going to leave that all your room the whole weekend. All right. I'm going to my room and I'm totally going to stay there all weekend. I'm going to take this off. Well, Marvin, you got the truth. <laughs> yeah, but we still don't know where Pumpkin is. Yeah, this can't really help with that. But hey, I'll leave it here so you can play with it. But I'm not entirely sure it's accurate because I haven't really calibrated it. But that little wiener thing was definitely true. <laughs> Wait, fuck, I said that backwards. It, see, it's not accurate. I calibrated it, so. <laughs> nah, he just, Brooklyn guy just got exposed, bro. I have a big wiener, Damn. Marvin, and I'm going to leave this here for... I think it... I think there's something give, wrong with it. Maybe you shouldn't give it up. I have a big wiener, and I'm gonna just ignore that. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna head out. But if I see a gray cat, I'm gonna let you know. It's orange. Let's see if this thing is truly accurate. I, Marvin, have a big wiener. Okay, but it's not small though. It's not the smallest penis in the world. How would you possibly even know that information? Oh, okay. Well, if I was in a room with ten guys, I'd be in the top three biggest. Oh, come on. L <laughs> after L after L. Oh, yeah, yeah. Turns out Jeffy's the one who left the door. <coughs> oh, well, Marvin, you know he's still just a kid. He's 19 years old, baby. Well, accidents happen. No, he did it on purpose. Oh, well, Marvin, we really should go look for Pumpkin. <sighs> Who's at the door? Oh, it's probably my package for a uh, big penis, like, reversal pills because mine's so big. <laughs> Liar! I don't know why it's screaming liar. <laughs> this is scream it, liar. It, it, it's not calibrated right, is what he told me. Hello? Oh, Pumpkin, you found him! Where's my reward? What? The paper said I'd get a reward. Oh, well, bring him inside. We'll discuss that. All right, I'm coming. Oh, Pumpkin, you're back. Where did you find him? He ran out in front of my Lamborghini and I almost hit him. The only reason I didn't is because I didn't want to damage my Lamborghini. Oh, well, thank you for bringing him back. Now, where's my reward? What? The paper said that there would be a... I mean, let's be honest, Mr. Goodman, it's not like you haven't used Rose before. So, Rose, you might have to go up and get, go upstairs and give up that. Because <laughs> you know Marvin ain't paying the rent. Money. Uh, baby, where, where's the money you're going to give him? I don't have any money. So then why the fuck <laughs> would you put reward on the paper if there wasn't going to be a reward? Well, I was hoping someone <laughs> would bring him back because he's our pet. Damn, I should have just hit him. Well, listen, Pumpkin's back. Everyone's happy. What were you doing coming here anyway? Well, I wanted to come get your house payment, but I'm assuming you don't have that. Uh, no, I have the house payment. Of course I have the house payment. I, I, I always have... put this on. Well, you don't even know what this thing is. It, it, it's a time machine. Do what? you have your house payment this month? Uh, of course I do. <laughs> Liar! <laughs> oh, listen, I have half of it. <laughs> Liar! <laughs> oh, okay, listen, I, I have most of it. <laughs> Liar! If you just give me till tomorrow, I'll have it. <laughs> Liar! <laughs> Next week, I'll have it. <laughs> Liar! <laughs> Next week, I'll have it. <laughs> Liar! Okay, listen, listen, listen. <laughs> hey, going in on this thing of Marvin right now. What doing. It's supposed to take you back in time or something. Marvin, do you even have your house I try to pay it every month. <laughs> don't, don't every day we sit on the couch and I go, oh, man, I'm going to pay my house payment this month. I, I, I'm really going to try to pay it. That's, that's what I'm going to do. Marvin just needs needs to give it up. <laughs> I'm going to cut off your balls and put them in a jar and pickle them. I'm going to have pickled balls and then I'm going to play pickleball with it. And I'm going to cut your balls off with the scissors that are in my ass. So I'm gonna give you a <laughs> He really got scissors in his ass. Oh my gosh. Start, Marvin, because I can't really <laughs> run that well with scissors up my ass. That's why they tell you don't not to run with scissors. So get running. <laughs> <laughs> what a way to go out, bro. Marvin just got everybody everybody in this episode got brutally. <laughs> <laughs> Jeffy, Jeffy <laughs> tried to do reverse psychology on the motherfucking lie detector test, which is crazy. He outsmarted it compared to everybody else. But all you got to do is tell the truth. A banger episode, though, as always. Before I get up out of here, if you guys like to follow me on my gaming channel, that link will be in the description down below. I appreciate you guys for the continued support. Love y'all, and I will see you guys in the next one, baby. We are out. Peace.